Hi friends, welcome back. Now, we are going to learn about AEC extended objects. First I create a rectangle as an outline of a plot. We can on the snap tool. For point visibility. Enable the options, midpoint and endpoint. Disable other options to avoid confusions. Now I'm selecting wall option from AEC extended. Enter the values of width and height of a wall. Choose the option left, it will create wall inside our rectangle. If it's right, we'll create the wall outside. Choose as per requirement. Pick the endpoints to create wall continuously. Draw partitions as needed. Go to top view. Now, have to insert door. Select doors option and select the type of the required door. Select the wall where door is to be inserted. I'm choosing pivot type door here. Just pick a point in inner side of the wall and drag towards length. Then, width, that is wall thickness. And at last go for height. We can enter the exact value in the properties panel. You can modify the door by changing its properties. Make it as double doors and flipping it. Can, we can open the door by increasing degree value. Increasing the door panels also. Both. Vertical and horizontal directions also possible. Next one is Windows. Select Windows option from drop down. Here also many types are there. Select as per requirement. I'm showing few methods, one by one. First I'm selecting pivoted type window. Place it as we did in door insertion process. Just pick a point and drag it towards length, width, and height. Adjust in property panel as we did earlier. Now we got the window in floor level, so we need it to move up to the head height. Look at axis which is indicating height of the window. Here it's Z axis. We need to enter value in below space, as I'm doing. Now it's in the position.
just adding few more types of windows and doors for other rooms using the same method. If you feel this video is helpful, please like, share, and subscribe to Yas Solution.